What is up everybody? My name is Joseph Allen. If you are on the website, awesome. And if you're watching this video through one of the other platforms, come on over to the website. I'd love to have you. Tons of awesome stuff to learn from. And with that all being said, let's dive into this video. All right, then we're going to bring it up through here. And there's going to be a little hole in there, and we're just going to slide it right through that hole, just the eye of the needle right there. Come on. Gets right in there, and we are going to pull it through. Here's where a lot of people do different things. I personally enjoy to uh, do this method. It guarantees that your guitar is going to stay in tune. A lot of people don't know that. They think you got to play for several days to uh, keep the tuning, uh, get, it, the, get the guitar to stay in tune. That's absolutely not true. You can keep a guitar in tune without ever playing on it or breaking it in. And I'm going to teach you how to do that right now. So follow these tips very, very closely. I want it tight. I don't want any room. A lot of people will leave room and wind it around, get a lot in here to go, and I, I don't want that. I want it, I want it tight. So... I want it tight, and what I'm going to do, it's hard to do this one hand, guys, with the, with the camera. <sighs> okay. Make that tight. You want just enough room to bring it over. that ah there we go pop it in right there and it's gonna sit right on top there you see how the string comes up and it goes literally around back here around that thing and then it comes through here over Okay, just like that, and it makes it really tight. And then when I start tightening, you want to make sure the string is sitting, that string on the thicker side, on the thicker strings they sit on the, the inside right here. You don't want them sitting on this side coming down. You want them sitting on this side coming down right there. It's very important. So it just doesn't get in the way and hit the other strings. So. I can get my little pro winder right here. Watching my bridge pin back there. What I want it to do is when it's going underneath this, guys, I want it to go underneath this part right here. I want it to slide underneath there. sweetness and that is the process to change one string and now we're going to go and basically apply it to all the others and I'll go ahead and tell you guys this now so when we get there but as you can see on my guitar the headstock right here you see how these strings all sitting towards even on this side all the strings line up they sit on the inside of the guitar stock right here sitting on the inside sitting on the inside, sitting on the inside. All my strings right here sits on the inside, sits on the inside, sits on the inside, 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 inside. And what that enables it to do is just not to hit the other strings and stuff like that or like these little brackets and stuff. It's just the best way to go about it. So now that we've done this, I'm going to apply it to all the strings and teach you guys the next step. 